Are you serious? Are you serious? What is going on? We've got planes flying sideways, trains derailing, and man cover holes exploding. What? Yes, all happening. Um, first of all, Colorado Springs, a train has derailed, filled with ammonia. Um, matter of fact, here's W, uh, let's see, uh, WKKTV Channel 11 News says, there's a train derailment took place on the 900 block of South Syria Madrid Avenue uh, near I-25 in Colorado Springs. The main concern right now is that the dry ammonia that was on board, it's not clear if any of the train uh, that tipped over was carrying any of this dry ammonia, but they're concerned. they got everybody staying inside to find out what is the situation. This is just taking place this morning. While that's going on in the United Kingdom, extreme straight line winds. We've been talking to you about these things. Extreme straight line winds begin to cause planes to fly sideways and a very, very significant struggle in getting these planes down. Thank God none of them crashed in this extreme uh, weather conditions, straight line winds, which we've been hearing and we've been talking about now for about a year and a half, they are going to increase. We're seeing that. And then while that's going on in Buffalo, New York, a manhole cover exploded um, and through the, the manhole cover blew it up into the air 100 feet. I've seen the video. It's insane. It comes crashing down. Fortunately, nobody was hurt. Then there was three more explosions there in the manhole. The area has been uh, cornered off. This was in Buffalo, New York. Just uh, crazy stuff that's taking place. Smoke rolling there. Uh, but again, fortunately, nobody hurt in these three different situations. All of them kind of getting the day started uh, in the last few hours. Uh, something apocalyptic is taking place. We'll just continue to keep an eye on all of it uh, as things develop, strange things develop around the world. We're living in the last days. And as we preached a message yesterday, the Lord told me, preach a sermon. And I did yesterday morning in our home church and uh, was the theme of last night's broadcast. There will be preach on great signs and fearful sights. And that's what we did. And thank God, four people were saved at our home church yesterday morning and 11 in the chat room live last night. And I don't know how many by radio or by archive or Roku satellite or, or cell phones or, you know, I don't know about all the rest of people out there listening, but we believe many other folks came to Christ. And if you're not saved, you need to do the same. We're running out of time.